hello my sisters guys I'm back for a YouTube video not today guys since you a year ago I posted a little tutorial for the first time about Stevie Universe where we heard about the single pelled roads and that was a year ago a year ago and my friend red that's just flying around hi red <laughs> Uh, actually was a part of that video and he was actually just flying around this in the entire video as well as this one and I built this I built pink diamonds palanquin to show off that pink diamond faked her shattering if you guys have not gotten to that part sorry about that spoil warning so I've been really waiting to do this next tutorial to, just to see how far this tutorial could go in one year I got Hold up, Red already knows this. He's he's already in shock because he didn't. We didn't. I literally talked to him and told him I didn't expect this to like be a big thing about my tutorial. I was wrong, Red. I owe you money. It, I got one thousand and thirty-eight views. Now that is epic. That's like past. That's that, that like past my original goal for that video. I literally said if we could get to twenty views on that video I, if i recall 20 views or 30 maybe it, it just in the in the thir in the two digits in the two digit digits that i will post another video you guys blew that apart i actually forgot about this promise until i watched this video so i'm going to keep up that promise and i will actually be doing the video where you guys actually said one of you guys said i should uh can you build the diamond ship um, I cannot build the diamond ships because I have not practiced enough to actually have that entire building part memorized. I actually can do the flags, but for now I feel like I would want to do something that people have been honestly um, been waiting for the most, if that makes any sense. And I think that what people have been trying to build is the injectors including Spinel's injector I've seen a youtuber like I said build this 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 is off of like me just looking at the map world and copying off there and I bet right now some of you guys are probably thinking why doesn't he just go to that map world take apart the diamond ship and do it layer by layer because when it comes to layering builds like layers of layers red can tell you that stuff takes time more time that I do not have and I can assure you, once I get to that point, and once I actually, once I can, I will definitely, wholeheartedly, will make that come true. I'll make that diamond ship, uh, blue diamond ship, her hand ship, and yellow diamond hand ship. Well, technically, by building blue diamond's hand ship, you could just switch the thumbs, or just flip the build in a certain direction, and do the opposite way or the opposite direction to get yellow diamonds hand ship. But I'm only doing the hand ships. Pink diamonds legs, can't do that. Probably could do white diamonds tor torso ship, I, th I think. I think. But it will take a while to uh, at least practice. I'm also gonna see if I could do the gym, like the, how do I say, the, uh, well at least, uh, I was gonna try to do the gym temple or the sky arena so th there's a few things i could build but for now um let's get into the tutorial okay so for you guys to start building this uh building this entire this beautiful injector which i actually wish that they had at least like uh i would say concrete walls because this would probably be all black like if we actually had a stair stair version of every single block and slabs and all that it would actually I would say it would improve the building skills of people and you will get like crazy ideas for it. But for now we will be using cobblestone since that is one of the items that you could easily obtain in the game and not have any problems. So if you guys are building a survival I totally will suggest to, I totally suggest to make this star. This star will help you plan everything out because it's legitimately oh god sorry I'm a little sick. It's legitimately, if you actually do count these out with these blocks, you are honestly getting, if I am counting this correctly, boom, 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 you are having a, 
11 by a 11 space and that I, I think that would be the small build at least because people say the smallest build that's ever been created it's just been one block but a lot of people just say that, that build is legitimately it's just a lamp post like a lamp post could fit inside a one door like it like, literally for a lamp post to be one let me move all these up to the let me yeah for you to build a lamppost, all you really gotta do is just have like blocks going up at a boom. Just set it to night so it only turns on at night. Like that that's your lamppost there. But once you add trap doors, people still think that's still in one block. No, that's that is that is technically a that is technically a not a three by three space, sweetie. A three by three space. So um let's get jumping into this. Uh so if you guys want to know how I did this, I actually did count up eight. But uh, by counting up eight, I was able to find that the eighth block sits right here. So I would honestly would say if you want to count up to eight, you can. So, but I this is just how I do it. You don't have to. And this is optional. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now. These two blocks here, the eighth, the very top block, the eighth block and the seventh block, you do not delete, but you delete everything else. Then you're going to go ace. You're gonna start by adding two blocks on each end. Now, a lot of people say, then do you start with the, you know, stone brick stairs? No, you do not. You actually, you actually start off, surprisingly, this, is not where you start off with. You don't start with this. You start with the tips. The the uh, what was it? The injecting tips. You add in one, two, three, four to represent the drill edges. Then you go down two. Sometimes people go down three, but I highly suggest not to because it looks better this way. Go down two in quartz blocks, and then press there. Now you have the tip of your drill. Now, this is when you go to the stone bricks and you actually just wrap it around. Just how you see, you just wrap this all the way around on the top. I'll, I'll highly suggest start with the bottom stairs, like what, what you guys are seeing me doing right now. Because it's a lot easier to place the top and for you to move on to the next part, which are going to be like, now, I've actually had people, like, I showed some people how to build this, and they wholeheartedly just started with the legs, but they feel as if doing this center actually helps you do the legs a lot easier. Now, you are going to place on the second, on the, on the second level of your stairs, the, where they're just, like, face-up stairs of your stone brick, you're going to place one cobblestone slab in the center, making this star... Like this X marks on the spot, this plus sign, full. Now under now under them, under these slabs, you're going to place facing inward a stair. A by the way, a cobblestone stair. Now with that cobblestone stair, you are actually going to take a cobblestone block, place it in front of your slabs. All the way around. Now you're going to go back to the stairs and place them simply facing inward on top of those cobblestone blocks. Now this is where we get to the legs. You're going to go one, two, three, four down with a cobblestone wall. And on the fourth block going down, you're going to the side of it, heading outward, then adding in those last walls so if you get this right it'll be four up one across four up it's just like doing a graph on it's just like doing the graph in your math class one two three four over one one two three and this is going to give you four but you know over one one two three four see it's it's very simple now I'll just do this to all the other sides and you will have the base of your injector. And um, I've actually have talked to, again, a couple group of my friends, I've talked to them and they have suggested for me to do 
uh, Spinel's injector uh, based off the movie. But for us to get to Spinel's injector, we need to understand how to build the original injector. The, the injector that actually start the injecting, the injectors that actually started off the rebellion. This is the, thanks to Pink Diamond seeing these injectors, she started an entire rebellion to fight the, well, to fight Homeworld. Now, I would say a lot of people would use white glass. I really don't like to use white glass because if you actually look at the reference pictures, it's actually magenta or more likely like, it's more like purple glass than it is anything else. But I've actually, and it's more like a magenta type glass on top. But if you want to do like red and white, you can. But I'm going to be trying to do this is based off the reference picture I'm looking at closest to it. So if you guys feel like, oh, he's changing at the last moment, I'm not. I only have those two glasses as like an option. I, I should really have mentioned that in the beginning of the ser search, yes. But these are, these, these are options. Red or blue, like in any type of color you would like. If you want to do a dark blue, light blue on top, dar uh, dark blue on top, light blue at bottom, you literally could do whatever you want. Now, you can pick any side of the injector. I like to make it, it really doesn't matter how is it pointing. Just simply go nine blocks high. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now, you guys think, oh, nine blocks high, right? That's just it, right? No, it is not. You add, you, we are going to go back to the bottom, back to the bottom, and adding two, only one block on each side of the plus. Now, we are going to leave this open for the glass that you see over there. Now, we're going to take our purple glass and go nine up on the front. And on the top two sides, you're going to go up eight. So following it all up at an even level. Now, with that in mind, you are going to take a cobble cobblestone, going up one block, putting that and adding uh, one block on each side, and you're going to add in that plus to show. Hey, this is the top. You're gonna add in in the middle another cobblestone block and add in two stairs facing outward to give you that pyramid-like look. Now, you think this is done? No. You're going to add in two glass of any of your choosing on high. And on the second, on the second block right here, you're going to add in another Plus, now you can make this three high, two high, however high you want. I'm gonna go three high. Because that looks very much like a gem to me. And you're going to add in a final block on top. And people, ta-da. This is how you build an injector. Now, if any of you guys want to have any other materials or any other way that you want to build an injector you can so i'm going to leave this tutorial up for you guys to decide how you want to build this if you guys enjoyed this video leave a like leave it below guys and make sure that if you guys want more stevie universe tutorials on a minecraft server to message and comment down below because you guys fucking blew up my viewing session and everything so hope you guys enjoy this video hope you whip it with this one bye